Hi, my Aries. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I'm doing your weekly spread for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. Also on the website, jamiezebra23.com, I've got full-size candles, do-it-yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits, crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense sage, um, protection bracelets, pendulum to divination and prophecy. I also have a 10-minute tarot card reading for $25. This is not the reading special. This is something different. This is something that will be on the website every single day. Oh, yeah. All right, so this is a general reading. This is not a personal reading, so it may or may not resonate. So please be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising videos for further insight. So my Aries, sun, moon, rising, Venus, and cross watchers. Okay, reunions, reconciliations. Somebody wants you back or you want someone back. Somebody's thinking about you because we do have the, the six of vessels, which represents water, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. Probably a water sign that wants you back. They're overly emotional in regards to you. But it looks like you're grounded. It, um, first, Okay, so of course there might be a few of you that do want to get back together with a water sign. That may be the case, but what this is telling me is that it's a water sign that wants to get back together with you. But you're firmly planted. Your feet are firmly planted on the ground. Um, you don't want that wishy-washy drama in your life. It's showing here that you guys, you know, you, it's, it's kind of like you just want to be invisible to whoever this ex is. You don't want to hear about what they're doing. You don't want to you don't want to hang out with them. You don't want them at family functions. Like you do not want to know anything. You want your whole family to block this person. You want nothing to do with them. Um, you might be hearing that uh, the reason why they want to get in touch with you is because they had like a recent breakup or a heartbreak. And now this water sign wants to get back together with you because it didn't work out with whoever they were with. Um, they're going to be overly sloppy, emotional. Um, it looks like somebody maybe got used. So, like, if they left you or you left them and they, there was, like, a break of some sort in a relationship, it looks like somebody got with somebody really quickly or they started sleeping around with several different people and, like, they kind of, like, um, they made a bad reputation for themselves. So it's kind of like, oh, yeah, now my whole neighborhood thinks you're a, you're a hoe. Um, so this could be a guy that did this, that, that started sleeping around with everybody or started dating super, super quick. And now everybody's, you know, got something negative to say about them. Could be a guy or a girl. But it shows here with the hooded man. Somebody just wants to, I feel like it's you though, that wants to just be hidden. Or this could be a Virgo. Um, they just want to be like, you know, just, oh my goodness, I hope this person didn't see me. Like if, if you're like out at a restaurant, you want to duck down so they don't even come over and say hi. It's that kind of energy. Like I just want to be left alone. Don't bother me. Yeah. I also see that for a lot of you, you're going to be... Um, having fun. I'm hearing like techno music, going out to clubs, going out to bars, just really enjoying yourself. I also see that some of you are going hunting. I don't think it's hunting season, but some of you are going hunting. Um, maybe you're hunting for a new job or you're hunting for a fortune or you're hunting for new love. Either way, some of you are on the hunt for something. Um, I do feel like some of you will be training people this week. So like, let's say you're a manager or you're an owner of a business, you might be training somebody. Um, or you work in a hospital, maybe you're going through training, maybe you're, it's educational. Uh, but it looks like some of you will be passing tests, you'll be doing very well. I also see that for some of you, um, you, you're, you might have a little bit of a health scare, or like, you know, maybe some of you are going to be, you know, having SEX, and then maybe something breaks, and you're like, oh my god, do I have something now? It's saying you're, you're going to be clean. Still, if you, I'm not a medical doctor, so make sure you go to the hospital if you think these things. But just for peace of mind, it's saying protection here. So use protection always. But also, it's saying you might be making a mountain out of a molehill. So you, you might not want to be doing that. Don't get yourself upset. Um, I do see that for some of you, big emphasis on Aries, on Aries energy that's going on. Or there could be an Aries with a Leo or a Sagittarius 
If so, I feel like there might be like a workplace romance budding. Somebody's got a crush on you at work. Somebody's got a crush on you at school. Maybe you go to the same grocery store, the same convenience store all the time. Who's ever over there has got a thing for you, has got a crush on you, wants to deal with you. I do see that for some of you around the holidays, like the Christmas, um, you know, uh, Thanksgiving, those kind of holidays, like winter, fall energy, I do see that a lot of your exes are going to be trying to return or you're going to be trying to return to exes. So be careful. So like, let's say an ex tries to get back together with you this week and you're like, no, I want nothing to do with you. You're trash. Get out of here. I feel like for some of you, you might have a change of heart and may want them back during that time, during the, during the holiday season. So be careful how you, um, how you treat them because they might not be open to reconciling with you when you want to reconcile, which is later on. All right, my Aries, have an amazing week. JamieZebra23.com. My readings are, whoops. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. People are, are texting me, and it's going over the top of the screen, and it, and it kind of makes me <laughs> forget what's going on. All right, so please like, share, subscribe, and comment. JamieZebra23.com. Ta-ta for now.